I've been just digging so many targets up here. A couple Wheaties, a bunch of zinc pennies, a couple relics in this spot right next to the sidewalk. Because the other, my other coils, my other coils can't come in here and get right next to the sidewalk because there's so much iron in that sidewalk there. I'm just hunting out here too. So it's going to be a penny right in there somewhere. Be a penny. Kind of sound like a penny. It's a dime. It was on its edge, probably. It was sounding pretty tight like a dime, but um, it just sounded like it was a little bit shallower than that. But I've dug up so many coins right here today. The, gra the ground is super dry and crumbly, but um, I've been spank smacking them out. Looking for a ring. Got to dig those targets out right there. It was unusual. I haven't gotten very many pencil racers today, and this one kind of sounds like a pencil racer. Oh, I was way off. The deep foil is reading up in the 80s and 90s today and especially in this spot here i've gotten quite a few nickels today too hit some cancel out right there a bunch of cancel out yep got it out wow but i've gotten several nickels right along this side right along the other sidewalk too right on right behind me the other side of the sidewalk i got three nickels and i got two over here just using this coil, man, because my other coils cannot do it. This one's something big. Oh, this one sounds killer, man. This one sounds really good. <laughs> right next to the iron, there's an iron pipe coming right there. Oops, I didn't want to do it that way. I'll go this way. Oh, man. Look at that. There's a big iron pipe right there going this way. And there's a coin right in here, I think. I think there's a coin in here. I believe so. Yep, there's a dime right there. That's amazing, man. See, that's what I've been talking about. The Amphibio you can really fine tune and the adjustments on the Amphibio The gain on the Amphibio really is a depth uh, indicator um, Just a, a small little increments can just go like a quarter inch at a time and it doesn't alter the tones It doesn't alter your uh, your clipping out on tones. It doesn't discriminate out like the simplex what I think the simplex does when you go lower on your tones there, it like discriminates it and it drops your volume level down and it alters your tones a little bit. I, it's just, it's hard to explain what it does when you go down on your, on your, uh, your gain on the simplex. See, watch, I'll dig this out here. I'm gonna go deep here. I'm gonna go deep. This is gonna be iron right here. I think it's gonna get some iron right there. Watch. There's gonna be a pipe going just like that right there. Watch this, man. Right here. Look at that. Iron. See that? Just solid iron right there. See that? Some iron just came off of it right here. It's, it's just crusty. See this? It's a big pipe right here. What the heck is that coming out of there? That's something weird. But it's a huge piece of iron right there, right? I knew it was gonna be a pipe. There's some more of that chunk there in the soil. But the other coils just are not able to do that next to that big iron. See? Big iron right there. Just 
smack that coin right out of there. Like this right here. There's something right on the surface. I think it's gonna be a nickel right on the surface. Right there. Right here. About an inch deep. Right there. It could be a pull tap too, but I think it's a nickel. Because this reading is so solid. Oh, come on, baby. Don't call me a liar. Right there. Just a little bit deeper. Is it a nickel? Come on, baby. Come out of there. Oh, come on. Oh, it's just a little bit off here. Is it going to be a nickel? Come on, baby. Just come out of there. It's a pull tab. I'm wrong a lot. But it was reading up just solid. Man. Man, I'm just tearing the ground up here. It's just so dry. What the hell was that? Like, it looks like a little pig over there. 